All it took was one win for the mood around this UMass football team to change. On Monday night, head coach Walt Bell tweeted how that win will still resonate in four or five years, saying maybe they will even put it in the documentary. Well, that tweet blew up around the UMass sports scene. Now t-shirts have been printed with Akron, the nine-point favorite on the front, and Bell's quote on the back. One big part of this change is quarterback Michael Curtis. He led the Minutemen to their first victory, and now he's number one on the depth chart. Going back to fall camp, you know, getting told that, you know, you're going to be the, the third guy on, on, on the depth chart after, you know, personally feeling like just putting in so much work and extra work over, I mean, the past three years, not just, you know, this summer or off season or whatever it may be. Um, and then just having the tenacity, resiliency, whatever you want to call it, to try to stick through that and keep a good mindset and keep pushing on and pushing on and preparing just for that possible opportunity to come about. And then that opportunity came about, and I'm just glad I was able to seize it. First time playing um, within the system, but I thought he did a really nice job managing the football team. We didn't have very many line scrimmage issues, didn't have any egregious, you know, uh, mistakes. And so I thought he did a really nice job, played with poise, played really under control. Even with Curtis leading the way, UMass is still a heavy underdog to FIU. In Amherst, I'm Chase Purrington, Amherst Wire Sports.